Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl just Ari here and I'm back again with another video. This video will basically be giving you my review on this unit that I'm wearing. But before we get into this video, y'all already know what to do. Click that subscribe button down below. Show your girl some love. And if you're interested in seeing this video, let's just keep on watching. So y'all, I know y'all hear it and I know y'all gonna say so, but my voice is leaving. I don't know what happened, but my allergies just came and smacked me upside my face and was like, I'm going to take your voice too. And that's basically what's going on right now. I don't know when I'm going to get it back, but I didn't want to, you know, go without giving you guys some, some serving you guys some looks. So I was just like, you know what, we're going to go through with this video. So let's just get right into it. So this um, unit that I'm wearing is the Jenna Collection. Um, extended part lace base deep part wig in the style Gabriella as you guys already know you probably knew that by the title and it is in the color OET 1B slash 27 this is their Swiss lace extremely deep part collection and let me tell y'all this wig is definitely big head friendly it's beginner friendly if you guys don't know like about this wig so many people have reviewed it before and i also did a review on it in black so if you haven't seen that video i'll link it down below in the description box so you guys can check that out definitely go show that video some love but i wanted to do it in like a blonde color and basically that's all I had to do was just put this wig on. Like, I did nothing else to this wig. It came just like this. It's so pretty, like the curls. Like, you think it looks pretty on camera, in person, it looks even better. So just imagine if you have one on your head, you would be in the mirror. You can't stop looking at yourself like, yes, girl, you better go ahead. But, um, this wig is heat resistant fibers and it's heat safe up to 360 degrees. I have seen a few YouTubers straighten this hair, but I don't think I'm gonna straighten this hair. Because I, like the hair is super soft. I did get a little bit of shedding, but that is because I had to pluck the part. This part is six inches deep, so it's like right here. They give you from here to here and that's it. Y'all don't get no other part of space. You might think that you could part this everywhere. That would have been cute, but it's not. You really literally only could part it in the middle, and that's it. I had to pluck the part, and then I did add some concealer just to make it look a little bit more natural and my skin tone, obviously. And that's all I had to do. I did lay some baby hairs in the front, and I mixed the wig, the wig baby hairs and my baby hairs and you know kind of slick them down just to make it look a little bit more realistic and that's all i had to do to this wig nothing else i didn't add anything to it i didn't run my fingers through it and you know um comb out the curls i wanted to wear it fresh out the pack for you guys just so you could see what it looks like my one disclaimer is that i got a default wig it seems like because right here this piece I don't know what happened to it, but it's just not looking like this side. And that's kind of killing me right now. So I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do to make it look even. Like, I don't know, like this side is giving me life. And then I turn to this side and it's like, I went outside and with a with a wand curled natural do and this part got wet. The like sis, like this is <laughs> It's gonna be so tight because this wig is so pretty and it's just like this piece. Like, y'all knew it was messed up when y'all sent it. Y'all should have just left it. And I do recommend this wig to anybody that wants to try it out. This is your wig. Like, this is a quick go-to. You're not really sure what to do to your hair. You got a date the next day. You got a you got a photo shoot. You got anything. You could just pop this wig on and go, girl. Like, you don't even have to lay the baby ears. If you don't want to, I know a lot of people really aren't into the baby hair look anymore. They just want it to look real natural. So you don't have to lay baby hairs if you don't want to. But I know me, I can't leave the house without it. So um, that's basically it. Um, if you want to purchase this wig, I'll leave all the details about this wig down below in the description box. So you can purchase it and where I did get it from. Because um, I really don't remember right now. And yeah, hold on, hold up. With my voice being going, I just, my throat just be dry constantly. But anyway, 
it's not about that it's about this hair um i do want to say this hair is pretty long and as you um as you wear it every day it will get bigger and bigger i know like with my black one it did that it got bigger and then it kind of like you know kind of got a little bit tangled in the nape area mostly so i'm trying to keep this wig as long as possible because i just think it's so beautiful um let me stand up and show you guys how far it falls on me if you stretch it it's like right there and then i'll turn around and show you guys the back and that's basically how it falls on me and yeah this is giving me like her vibes like she i just love this wig it's absolutely beautiful and if you guys want to purchase this wig definitely i recommend it absolutely just like the black one and they have another array of colors so if you guys go on the website you can see how many colors that they do have so definitely go check that out i appreciate you guys watching this video with you know the sore you know raspy voice and all i just love i just love you guys i appreciate y'all i love y'all and i'll see you guys in my next video don't forget to comment on this video down below let me know what you guys think have you purchased this wig already and that's it i love y'all Peace out.